Hey everyone, I'm Dustin. I have nearly 20 years experience in the bike and e-bike industry and today I'm going to show you an electric tricycle that's great for heavier riders. Stick around. All right, so today we're going to show you and demonstrate our electric trike that's great for heavier riders. But before we do, hit that subscribe button below. Stay in touch with us here at 630. Be the first to know about all the new content we're putting out, giveaways, and of course, new product releases. All right, so right here we have our 630 electric rickshaw tricycle, but this is just also a great multi-purpose trike. We do have the seat on the back, um, but again, this rides like a normal e-trike, and we're gonna demonstrate that today. And I have Adam with me here on my left, and Jasper here on my right. And Adam, how much do you weigh? Oh wait, let me get my microphone out. Uh, I weigh 340 pounds. And how tall are you? About 5'10". Okay, perfect. And Jasper, how about you? I'm 5'9", 250. Okay, perfect. So what I wanted to demonstrate is how uh, our e-trike here, 750 watts, how this can perform with heavier riders. We have a lot of riders out there, questions. Um, I would say a majority of adults that contact us are over 200 pounds and they want you know something that gives them enough power. So we're gonna to demonstrate today, not only each of them riding it individually, but then we're gonna show you them riding it with uh, one of them on the back as well. So again, this is a 750 watt. Let me go ahead and put my mic back on here. Um, electric trike, the motor's in the front hub here. The other benefit is we have a 21 amp hour battery. So you're gonna get 20 to 50 miles of range and you're also gonna be able to hit top speeds of 20 miles an hour if you just use the throttle, and 28 miles an hour if you're in pedal assist as well. Also, you have 24 inch, uh, four inch wide tires in the rear, or sorry, 20 inch in the rear, and 24 inch in the front. So it's set down lower in the back to give it a better uh, center of gravity. So that's gonna prevent tipping, make it more nimble, easier to steer, and it's also great when you have the passenger in the rear as well, because you want that weight down uh, to make sure the bike has a low center of gravity. So we're gonna demonstrate how easy it is to ride, uh, how fun it is to ride. The other benefit of the four inch tires provides a real cushy ride. You can go over bumpy terrain, things like that. So if you're riding by yourself, you wanna go on some hard packed trails, no problem. You also have the seat belt in the back here. Uh, for safety of the back rider. Nice oversized seat here. A lot of questions about can we replace this seat. Yes, you can easily change this seat, put a seat with a backrest on that is available to you uh, if you're interested in a trike. You have your display up here, uh, all your pedal assist functions up here. And if you're looking for more info on this uh, e-rickshaw trike, you can check it out on our channel. We've made a lot of videos about all the specs, how it performs, everything like that. Lastly, it has three disc brakes, one on the front wheel, two on the rear, so stopping power is gonna be ample. So if you are a rider over 200, 250, 300 pounds, we're gonna show you how it stops great. And uh, yeah, and in addition to that, um, easy to use calipers up here when you pull these. So again, we'll show you all that in the demonstration. So who wants to go first? I'll do it. Okay, all right, Adam, so go ahead and hop on. Let me know about the seat as well if that's too high, too low. Go ahead and grab the brake when you get on. Yeah. There you go. There we go. How's the seat? Pretty comfortable. Too high, too low, okay? Uh, yeah, it feels okay. Okay, cool. All right, so if you wanna go ahead and we'll turn it on right here. There we go. All right, so now you are in level five. Let's just turn it down a little bit. Yeah. And if you can just go, yeah, make a little loop through the parking lot. And you can try the throttle as well. Yeah. It's pretty nimble for having a seat on the back, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, I was expecting a, a shorter turning radius, but like this is, it's pretty nimble. Yeah. What Adam said, if you can hear, he said he's surprised by the turning radius and how easy it is to turn. 
Uh, you can do one more loop just more. by the red curb and come back over there too, yeah. Yeah, it's very responsive, isn't it? <laughs> he said he likes that assist when it comes to getting started. And you can see the motor, and the motor's responsive, still gets him going, and we only have him in level two right now. And I'm just barely, barely kissing the motor too. Yeah. And it's only on two. <laughs> <laughs> so for your weight, you feel like it would give you the power you need. Easily, easily. Cool. Yeah, definitely. All right, Jasper, your turn. So Jasper's 250 and Adam's 350. So we'll see. And we can lower the seat or raise the seat. Seat's pretty good. Okay. Yeah. All right, now if you've never ridden a trike, Jasper's never been on an electric trike before. So, when you come into the turns, just lay off the acceleration. Yeah. I mean, that's the usual, always the hardest part of, uh, of riding a bike or trike or whatever, is getting started, that, that initial push. When you, have that, when you have that assist, you know, it's just, it's easy, <laughs> so easy to get started. Yeah. And you've ridden our other e-trikes before. And e-bikes, yes, yeah. And it, it's, <laughs> I would even say this one has more power, definitely. Well, it does, this is a yeah. motor. Yeah. yeah. So it, it's it's definitely super easy. But what, and then with the seat you said, do you even really notice that there's a seat back there when you're driving it? Not at all, I did not notice there was an, a seat back there. It was just as if I was on another tricycle, you know. Yeah. Cool. It, did you feel the same way too? It's easy to yeah, steer? Definitely. Uh, when you said rickshaw, I was like, I mean, those move pretty fast, but I was still skeptical because it's kind of like a bike still, but it doesn't feel like there's a seat back there at all. It picks up so fast, even without the accelerator. Yeah. It's pretty crazy. Cool. <laughs> oh, wow. All cool. right. Well, let's go ahead and leave Jasper on. Now, Adam, can you go ahead and get on the back? Let's do it. And now let's just uh, be, you know, extra careful here. <laughs> right. Brakes yep. engaged. And just stay away from the cars here. Stay close to the left. Okay, so we've got a combined weight now of about 600 pounds between the two of you guys. All start then, sir. <laughs> there we go. All right. Safety first. And you can, you can also increase the pedal assist if you need more power. Get ready. And you don't even need to stand up, honestly. Right. Like, <laughs> and you're only in pedal assist too. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Night and day from an unassisted. Let's uh, let's rotate and see Adam driving. I mean, there wasn't even really a difference, right? <laughs> really, for this. Wanted or not, like. How did as it feel steering the, him on the back? The steering, it, it was the exact same. Yeah. And I mean, I expected because there was someone back there for it to like drag a little, but not at all. Yeah. It's still the exact same. That's great. That's awesome. Good to hear. All right, Adam, go ahead and uh, take him for a ride. All right. That's it. And yeah, they're only in level two right now. And you can always increase the assist if you need more power. I mean, honestly, I don't even need more. <laughs> like, maybe if you're going uphill, you might need more, but like this, absolutely fine. So he was just saying he doesn't need more power, maybe if we're going uphill. So you can feel the powers there if you need it. And again, uh, 600 pounds right here, and they're only in level two. And pretty comfortable back there, isn't it? Very comfortable. Yeah. It's a great ride. <laughs> yeah. 
it's just a smooth, straight ride. I and really again, like it. And again, no difference with with or without a, a rider. Yeah. Still easy to steer. Still easy to steer. Still uh, easy to maneuver. Yeah. That's cool. Well, there you have it. We got our two um, our two riders over 200 pounds. Adam at three about 350, and Jasper at 250. Individually, they like the ride, and together they like the ride too. So you can check out this bike on our website, 630.com. And if you have any other questions at all, you can comment below or email us, the team at 630.com, or call us, 310-982-2877. If you're in the market for an electric trike and you don't know what you want, you can go to our website, take our proprietary body fit quiz, answer a few questions about your body and your life. We'll recommend the perfect e-trike e-bike for you. Also, you have a 30-day test ride your e-trike e-bike policy. If you don't love it in 30 days, send it back. No questions asked, no money out of your pocket. And you get a full one-year warranty on everything here. Uh, anything goes wrong, we'll take care of it within a year. And lastly, be a part of our community, our Facebook Peddlers Group, and download our app. Great place to connect with existing riders before you purchase. Ask them questions, see how they like their bike. Then after you have yours, make new friends, track your rides on the app. It's a ton of fun. So thank you for sticking around and don't forget, it's your journey, your experience, enjoy the ride.